Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this quick tutorial video, I will show you how to free up space on your Mac by moving your photos library to an external drive. I will also give you a tip on how to extend your MacBook storage for a relatively low price. Without losing more of your precious time, let's get started. Step number one. Prepare your external storage device. Connect your physical external storage device to your Mac. You can use any external SSD, hard drive or even SD card. Make sure the device is formatted for macOS file format, either in APFS format or macOS extended, journaled. Avoid using storage devices that are already used for time machine backups or are shared over the internet. Step number two. Locate your photos library. Quit the photos app if it's open. Open Finder and navigate to the folder that contains your photos library. By default, it's stored in the pictures folder of your home directory. If you can't find your photos library, you can open your photos app, click on photos, settings, library location, show in Finder. Step number three, move the photos library. Drag the photos library file to a location on your external storage device. For example, in my case, I will move it to my external SSD. Wait for the transfer to complete. Note that the transfer process can take from several seconds to half an hour, depending on the size of your library. If you want to save space on your Mac, you can now delete the original photos library from its original location on your Mac, the pictures folder. Just drag it to the trash bin and then empty the trash. Step number four, access the library. After the move is finished, Double-click on the Photos library in its new location to open it. Congratulations, you just moved your Photos library from your Mac to an external storage. You can now add new pictures or videos to your Photos library and it will be automatically saved on your external drive and not taking space on your Mac. Important information. Remember that to be able to access your library, you have to connect your external storage device to your Mac. Otherwise, your computer will not be able to locate it. Always ensure that your external storage device is turned on and available before opening the Photos app on your Mac. If Photos can't find the device where your Photos library is located, it will create a new empty library at the default location. To open a different Photos library, just press and hold the Option key while opening the Photos app and select the desired library. If you have MacBook Pro 14 or 16 inches, you can purchase a tiny SD card that permanently stays inside your Mac SD card slot. That way, you can expand your Mac storage for a relatively low price. If you are interested, check out my video on that topic. The link will be in the description. That's it. You've successfully moved your Photos library to an external drive, freeing up valuable space on your Mac. If you found this video useful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more useful tips. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.